can't see me because it's extremely dark out. It's about 5 a.m. Very early, very dark. So I'll kind of talk more when it's a little bit brighter out so that you can see my face, even though you probably don't want to see my face. I'll see you when it's a little bit brighter outside, okay? But just know that I'm up this early. Like, just give me some credit for being up this early. Write this down in the history books that I am up this early. It probably will never happen again. But now that I got my street cred, uh, I'll see you when it's light outside, okay? Yo, sorry for the shitty ass lighting. It's super red and weird as fuck. I haven't really told you what I'm doing yet, so let me tell you that now. So I'm in San Francisco today, early in the morning apparently, because I forced my father to do a sunrise photo shoot with me because I'm pushy and I like having Instagram photos to post. We're meeting at Phil's. Gonna take you along with me today? <laughs> Vlog life! Okay, well we're gonna turn left now, so, I mean right. Okay, see this is why I'm stupid my life. Okay, well, anyways, sorry about that, guys. A uh, little bit of technical difficulties. Holy shit, people hate me. Oh my god, I don't know where I am. I'm so lost! Fuck! You don't even know what we're doing yet, and I'm already lost. Oh my goodness gracious. It's going to be lit, and it is lit every single day, bro. I haven't had a coffee yet today, so I'm really glad that we're meeting at Phil's this morning. And I also haven't been to this Phil's in this area before. I usually only go to the Phil's near where I live, so I always like to try new things. But first, I have to get to Phil's. That's the thing. And so I'm close, but you know what? You're never, but still, just a little bit. Just a little bit confused. I will see you when I get there. I'm excited to take some pictures because I have kind of a fun outfit on. I'll give you a quick little OOTD. My pants are from Brandy. My shirt is thrifted. My jacket is from Brandy. My hat is from Forever 21. Glasses are from Amazon. These were literally my Napoleon Dynamite glasses for my costume, so that's kind of funny. I was really sad because on the way here- In a quarter mile, turn left onto Folsom Street. Turn left or right? Okay, this is why my life is hard. Sorry guys, you're just gonna have to stay down there for a second. I really wish I could prop my phone up so I have to just hold it like this, like a freaking Weenie Hut Jr. And it freaking sucks. Destination is on your left. Okay, but now I have to freaking find parking and I have no clue where to go to for that. I have no clue where to find parking. Okay, just wish me luck. I'll see you when I'm done with all this shit. Okay, update after lots of hard work, dedication, grind, and just overall, just really putting all matters aside and just prioritizing finding a parking spot. I found a parking spot. We found a parking spot. Actually, there's my dad. He has his camera because I'm forcing him to take photos of me. That's what it's like to be related to me. It was so hard to find parking and it's so busy and people hate me. People don't like me on the roads. People are not the biggest fan of me. Maybe it's because I drive like a grandma. I don't know, up for debate, but this is really off topic, but I ate pasta last night before I went to bed. I literally ate pasta at like 12 a.m. And then I woke up this morning and I'm still full from eating pasta and I hate that. I hate that, I'm never gonna eat that late at night again. Just feeling a little bit farty from the pasta. I'm gonna cut that out, that was gross. So, um, it's not easy to say this, but we're kinda out here, boy. <laughs> we in these streets, you feel me? <laughs> we out here, we in these streets, you I don't feel think me? I can say that. Yeah. See, this is why I like having my dad with me, because I'm not like filming from like a double chin angle. He can film for me at this nice angle. He could've held the door for me. <laughs> I love cocaine. <laughs> she is beauty. She is grace. <laughs> she is miss. <laughs> she is miss United. No, let me finish. She is beauty. She is grace. She is miss United. United States. Beyonce in here and I am uncomfortable. She is the queen and I just don't even feel like I deserve to be in her presence. Do you know what I mean? All right, I just took a fat shit. Now let's go take some pictures. It's where I live. It's my lifestyle. I don't know. This is just my lifestyle. Crossing streets, being in these streets. I don't know. Keeping everyone on their toes. It's just my lifestyle. Some people, they might hate you. Others, they might love you. You just can't win around here. All right. And that's it. I'm just feeling so much like me now. I had my coffee. I took a shit. I am at my absolute best right now. I'm just feeling alive as fuck. I went to bed at 1 a.m., woke up at 4.30 or something, or 4.45, I don't know. Slept for like four hours, no, like three and a half hours. But I'm feeling woke as fuck. I'm feeling pretty woke too. Woke and broke. Me too.
Okay, I just farted, but you couldn't hear it. Sorry, I know you guys want me to start farting on camera, but that one wasn't loud enough. Oh my god. All y'all motherfuckers come to San Francisco to look at this, yeah, to look at the Golden Gate. Y'all sleeping on the Bay Bridge, motherfuckers. No one out here looking at the Bay Bridge. Everybody out here looking at the Golden Gate because everybody like going. No, fuck that. We respect the Bay Bridge. <laughs> I'd say the pictures are going pretty well. I kind of feel like I have to shit again. You know, that's kind of what caffeine will do to you. But besides that, we're doing really great. I don't say know. we're heading to the ferry building. What? Say we're heading to the ferry we're building. Heading? Okay, well, my dad's making me tell you guys that we're heading to the ferry building. It's nice and foggy out, which is my favorite kind of weather. I don't personally like when it's sunny because I am a sad person. And so today's foggy and I'm just really in my element. I don't know. Where are we going? Oh, yeah, we're going to the ferry building because my dad's making me tell you that because he likes when I <laughs> include context and setting in my vlogs. Now it's time for a story about the ferry building. I uh, used to work down here and I used to deliver uh, for DHL. And I used to go into the ferry building every day and the place was a virtual dump. No, I can't tell. It's an inappropriate story. Sorry, kids. <laughs> Wait, what? Hey, you yeah. can't just do that. Just I used to use the restroom in there and all over the walls, like they would write with magic markers and they were looking for dates. Somebody was like, if you're interested, be here in this bathroom stall at this particular time on this particular day. And I like looked at my watch and I was like, I'm here. I gotta get out of here. <laughs> smells like Philly cheesesteak. I don't even know what that smells like. I've never eaten it. <laughs> Quick little disclaimer to all my gluten frees out there. Hope that that imagery didn't offend you. I try not to eat gluten except for that I eat bagels a lot. It's hard for me to control myself around bagels. La cocina. See, I can speak Spanish. I don't know why people think that I'm illiterate and that my vocabulary is small. I'm very smart. Look how, okay, I'm sorry. I'm not trying to be mean or whatever. That fog looks pretty as heck. I'm trying to say less bad words. I cuss a lot in these vlogs. Looks good to me. So my dad wants me to stand on this for some photos. This is the peak of my athletic performance. Look at this. Oh, it wobbles. Oh, okay. Wait, wait, wait. Can this I still area. try to stand on it? I don't know. It's like, is I it really sketchy? don't want to die. Oh, okay. Now you no, can... I can do it. Anyway. Oh, this is bad for me. That one's the most, well then, this one's wet on top. Do you know what, guys? I'm not trying to risk my life for a freaking picture. Normally I would, but I just like, honestly, if I'm gonna fall and not die, never mind. I'm Tell not gonna you what, get let dark me, here. Yeah, let me... Any time, any day, you can hear the people say that love is blind. Well, I don't know, but I say love. Oh, <laughs> now that, my friends, yeah, that nutcracker worthy, I'm telling you. Black Swan quaking a little bit, not trying to offend anybody. Call me the Black Pigeon, bitch. Who the f Cool your jets, buddy. I'm just gonna give you guys a little history lesson right now. It's gonna be pretty interesting. So a new law has just been passed and it is in place right here. It's called the Dolan Law. It's obviously a big deal. The examiner trusts it. Well, let me tell you a little bit about it. So if you are between the ages 12 and 20, you have to be subscribed to the Dolan Twins and you have to like all their photos. And mentally, you also have to be just a little bit in love with them or else- You're going to jail, sis. Is that stupid? I'm tired, I'm wrecked. It's like 9 a.m. No, it's like 8 a.m. It's like 8 a.m. And we're gonna go into another freaking fills. Round two. I'm not proud of it. It's always so awkward because right after they give you the drink, they like taste it and make sure it's perfect. Usually I'm just like, oh yeah, 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 yeah. it's good. What do you say if it's not good? How do you even bring it up? I just don't want to hurt anyone's feelings, but at the same time, it's like, sometimes I'll accidentally, accidentally, I'll say ice and they'll give me hot and I'm just like, I'm just gonna let it pass. I don't want to make them sad. I don't want to make them go home and cry or something. So like, I don't know. I just don't say anything if they mess up. This is decaf. You're welcome. Now we're gonna download the photos onto my computer. Hopefully they turned out good. And if they didn't, I'm gonna sue my dad for wasting my time. You can't sue me. All right, back in the car. 
I've calmed down a little bit. I know I was quite high energy earlier, but I feel the exact opposite right now. It's literally 9.44. It is so early in the day. I literally still have the whole day ahead of me. I love that about early morning days. I have like a huge issue with like running out of time. Next thing I know, it's like midnight and I haven't, and I still have shit to do. Yeah, I had a really good day with my father, but I'm gonna go home now. And I feel like I haven't really talked to you guys in a while, so I decided on the way home, I would just kind of talk to you guys about what's up. I was thinking about staying in the city for a little bit, hanging out, maybe doing a little bit of shopping, but I have shit to do. I have a video to edit and I have shit to do. I might even go to Phil's near where I live and like edit today, which would be kind of overkill. Not overkill, but like I've already been to Phil's twice today. Like imagine me going to Phil's for the third time. I think I'd lose my brain.